Okay, hi everyone, welcome to today's video and today we are going to go through the Caddock 2 Cook 2 Pro stove. So let's take a look at that now. Okay, hi everyone, welcome to today's video and today we are going to go through the Caddock 2 Cook 2 Pro stove. So let's take a look at that now. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is take it out of the bag. So let's have a look at the bag now. So it's a decent bag. It's pretty good quality as you can see and it's a decent size. So we're just going to lift that out. And on top of the bag there is this velcro pocket that has the hot plate in and the griddle in and the hot plate in so we're going to take those out quickly and we're just going to put the bag to one side for the time being okay so this is a gas hob so if we come and look down the side here we can see that it comes with this i think the newer ones might come with a quick release connector but this one came with a normal gas where you put the pipe on here however um, it does also come with a spanner and we've taken this off and replaced it with something else. Don't forget that this does have a reverse thread so to undo it you have to turn it clockwise. So let's undo it now. So it is done up tighter than this but it does come with a spanner as well but we've already loosened it. So we're going to put that to one side because we have one of these quick release um, connectors so that we can just screw it on simply like that. I won't do it. So that just screws on like that, tighten it up. We can then change that between our two gas stoves that we've got. We've got this Kadak and we've also got the Safari Chef 2. So that is a simple quick transfer on the, um, on the gas. So that gets you from the fixed pipe to the quick release pipe that we've just fitted. So I'm just going to unscrew this now so that I can move the stove around a little bit easier to show you. So basically looking at the front here, it's very simple, little catch here, which opens one side, little catch here that opens it up and you've got two, um, two rings on here. Uh, push button starter, so you just turn the gas on as you would normally and it might slide on here when you're pushing it so you just need to maybe grip it and start it like that we're obviously not going to fire it up today um, but it does normally start really easily this can act as a wind deflector at the back um, and there isn't a wind deflector around the side but we have bought a separate one as you can see here that just goes around the outside to protect it or to, to shelter it from the wind um, and that's pretty much is it as uh, that's pretty much it as a stove and we'll now show you the sort of different combinations you can do when cooking between the different rings and stuff and let me interrupt here for a second if you're liking this video why not click that thumbs up button and if you really like the video head over and subscribe to the channel so um, I'm just going to tell you a little bit about um, the grill pans and the grill the rings that come with the Kadak okay so um, it comes with the two rings so you can do um, cooking on the ring so put a pan on and um, I don't know you might want to cook spaghetti bolognese or something like that so you can use those or you can take these off and swap them for what comes with it is um, the griddle and the hot plate so you could um, so we've done steak on the griddle and we did potatoes on the normal one um, and again you could take both of them off and use the griddle and the hot plate so they're very versatile you can swap them around cook whatever you want there's um, I know Kadak do a cookbook but you can just do your own cooking recipes we've done eggs um, poached eggs on this a little bit of water bring to the boil with the egg rings we put the eggs in and a lid on top and they poached them really quite nicely um, 
we also did garlic bread on this flat garlic bread it was rather than no baguettes that worked out really well on the hot plate i was quite surprised i wasn't expecting it to and obviously burgers sausages steak um really easy to clean i have to say i was quite impressed at how easy they were to complete uh, clean we've used them a few times and look at that looks like they're brand spanking new they do must be the person that does washing up or <laughs> or, or how well Kadak have made it non-stick you know it's really good very good amazing so i'm really impressed we were toing and throwing about which one to get or i was um the reason being sometimes it can get a bit cramped in the um van when it comes to cooking and with the summer coming up i thought oh maybe something different to cook outside on so i was toing and throwing with different options obviously this is a little bit more expensive because we have got the camping gas mini stove we showed you in another video and now i know they do a bigger stove two hobs um and they do a grill underneath and i was umming and ahhing about getting that um but as somebody said you pay for what you get for really um and it's true amazing really pleased because i think we'll get lots of use out of this over the next few years and it's good that it's got a storage case for the extra and little grippy feet come on with we see those turn over money turn over shows the feet little grippy feet come on it's there come with it but it's there yeah okay so really good cool I think probably just be careful when it comes to washing up don't use anything hard abrasive just you know and it did, everything came off really easy we cooked steak on this the other week and it's come out nice and clean and it's got look little holes here this is where your fat runs into apparently mm -hmm. really well made piece of equipment by Kadak well done so there we go that is our quick review of the two cook two pro stove by Kadak. i think you can tell that we like it and we are going to enjoy using it on our trips that are coming up so thank you for watching if you got some value from this video why not give us a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to the channel for lots more content on all things camping and travel see you next time happy travels mm -hmm.